it's, it's never bad weather, it's just bad preparation. So as long as you dress for the weather, you can always have, have a good time. Students at St. John's and St. Ben's had a good time today celebrating their win in the first ever Outdoor Nation Campus Challenge. Jenny Cutter of St. John's Outdoor University says entering the competition was a no-brainer. Um, Outdoor Nation is a nonprofit organization that sponsored the contest and we applied and they selected 10 schools across the country and then we had the summer to prepare and for eight weeks of doing our best to inspire as many people as we could to be outside and active. Well, this was the first year that Outdoor Nation sponsored this competition, so we are the first winners and, you know, hopefully we'll be the biggest winners going forward. For the competition, students could do up to five outdoor activities a day to score points, and St. John's student Pierce Jensen was the leading point getter. Like, so I, I, I was an Eagle Scout and things like that, so I kind of always had a love for the outdoors, and I lived in the country um, when I was growing up. So, yes, yeah, so I, I was the uh, most outdoorsy person um, for St. Ben's St. John's. Um, so what I did to do that was I logged um, five activities a day. So that means I was outside for at least uh, two and a half hours um, each day. So I kind of had to get creative a few days. Um, but usually some of my like common activities um, were uh, kind of biking from one campus to the other, or just going for hikes out in the Arboretum at St. John's, uh, stuff like that. As part of winning, the schools got $10,000 in outdoor gear as well as money to host the celebration. And so today we've got a whole host of exciting outdoor activities in this frigid, frigid weather. We're serving hot pancakes and maple syrup and just a chance to get people out and enjoying the day and winning some prizes along the way. For WJON, I'm Isaac Schwer.